What's the little things in life? Um, it's funny enough, today is a prime example. I've got a bird table over here. Um, when I get stressed or stuff, and funny enough, sometimes I do get stressed, um, I will take a bit of time out and go and watch the birds or go and think about something completely different because you separate yourself from the nonsense in life. Um, and a lot of it is nonsense because a lot of the world today is ruled by politics and policies. Um, so you need to disconnect yourself. And I recommend everybody does it on a regular basis. Set times away. That's why you'll see a lot of people get so involved in a sport, for example, become obsessed by it because a lot of the time their life is crap. Um, and I don't say that in a negative way. It just is. You know, there's not a lot outside of the sport. <laughs> you know, they may have marriage problems. They're sitting on a metal press or something. You know, they, it's just the, the monotony of everything, which means that they focus so much on the sport because that is their escapism. Um, but it's not a bad thing. That's the funny thing. It's not a bad thing. So although their life's mundane or whatever, that's not... Although that is you know, can be an issue. They're happy with that way of life because they've shut down to a lot of the stuff that they're not going to change. Um, but they will focus on the football. The football becomes everything. Um, nothing wrong with it. Not having that dedication and focus on something because it means that you're not getting yourself down. You're not depressed. You're not letting things affect your life so it's important that you do spot the small things i mean it's like today i've got sitting looking at sunflowers and stuff i don't let things drag me down to a point where i suffer with stress um that's why this is an important thing i don't let things drag me down to um to cause me stress which is like long-term stress um I may get stressed at times, which is where you go, right, stop. I'm going out for five minutes. I'm going to go and have a look at the plants, switch off. We'll go and watch the birds, feed the birds, go fishing for the day. That is a disconnect. And it's important that when you do disconnect, all that stuff that was bothering you for the day, get rid of it. Don't even think about it. Um, come back to it. Um, I think Germany is the best at this, though, because it's like when they finish work, 5 p.m., stop. Mid-sentence, whatever, it stopped, you go. 5 o'clock, you finish. Nothing wrong with that whatsoever, because they actually understand the difference between work and uh, your private life. Um, I agree with that 100%. They shouldn't um, impact each other. And that's why it's important that you have some disconnects. And it could be like just watching, like I say, I'll watch the birds because we have some um, interest in wildlife. But you need to have that in your life. If you haven't, create something. Find something. There's something around you that you can do. Um, I like sketching as well. So I'll do sketches when I have time. But the advantage with the birds and stuff is I can just hop in the car and just step out of the car, sit down with a book or whatever, and just sit and watch and read, you know, just chill out, completely disconnected from anything that is bothering me. And that's, these things are very important in having a healthy life. All right, thanks for watching.